great to have you. I love that you guys do these Art After Darks. Um, I've been to them before, they're so much fun. Before we talk about the Art After Dark party, let's talk about the new exhibit. Well, actually, this ex ex exhibition is closing April 7th. So oh. if you want to see it or you haven't seen it yet, tonight is the perfect time to come oh, see good. it. Okay, so Normally it is ticketed, but tonight you can see it for free. Oh, that, that is so cool. That's one of the great things about the Art After Dark is not only is this kind of a party around these things, but um, the fact that you can go for free and see some of these exhibits that maybe you might have to pay for. Now, sometimes these exhibits that are uh, in addition to the regular collections do cost money. So are there certain days where people can come for free as well if they can't make it tonight? Absolutely. So all throughout uh, April, you can see Clearly Indigenous, Native Visions Reimagining Glass, and Woodfield Lavelle Passages, which is our other ticketed exhibition, for free every single Tuesday, every Thursday evening from 5 to 8 p.m., and actually this whole weekend, you can see both of those exhibitions oh, for free nice. as well. Yeah. That'd be a great thing for people to do, too, if you've got family in from town, yes. maybe for Easter, and you're looking at some wonderful things to do. So tell us about both of these exhibits. So Clearly Indigenous, Native Visions Reimagined in Glass. It's a beautiful show. Not only is it aesthetically beautiful by looking at all these wonderful glass works, but it's also very um, academic. It is impactful. It teaches lots of great lessons uh, about issues affecting Indigenous people, and you can learn about um, their cultures and some of the traditional stories and knowledge. And every single piece is in wow. glass. Even if it doesn't look like glass, it is glass. Those are just stunning pieces. Yes. Very neat. And then there was another exhibit you mentioned as well. Whitfield Lovell Passages, that opened at the beginning of this month, and that runs through the end of May. And it's an immersive exhibition. Um, uh, this is a contemporary artist. He was, we were actually very, very proud to host him when the exhibition started. And it is so impactful. It tells really, really good stories about the um, African-American experience in our history. Wow, well, some, some really great cultural experiences yes. to take in with these both of these. And then yes. tell us about the event tonight. I love that it's free, anybody can come, Everybody. and you offer kind of immersive experiences when you come to the Art After Dark. Absolutely. So not only can you see both of these amazing exhibitions for totally free, um, we are going to have food for purchase from the Indigenous Chef Food Truck. Oh, neat. We are going to have cash bars throughout the museum, uh, music from DJ Creeping Bear, and something very, very special. Um, we are going to have a, a live uh, an artist there who has been doing live art making in our great hall. He was here all day Thursday. He's gonna be here all day today in our galleries uh, creating artwork. And then tonight, uh, his name is Leonard Harmon. He is an wow. organ-based indigenous artist. We will be raffling off that piece and all the proceeds will benefit the Urban Native Collective. And they have been a wonderful partner to us on this event tonight. That is such a neat yes. opportunity to watch somebody create create a live piece yes. of art and then have the opportunity to purchase that. Absolutely. Wow, Absolutely. wonderful. Is there anything else people need to know to come tonight? Parking, I know it might be a little different up there. Yes, we have two great parking lots, but they do get pretty jam-packed. So come early. Um, the event is from 5 to 9 p.m. tonight. If you want, you can even come during our regular open hours uh, and just kind of claim your spot. Yeah. Or uh, we also recommend doing a, a ride share service. Or there's also off-site parking throughout uh, Mount Adams, too. Well, that is wonderful. Yes. What, uh, love these Art After Darks. And in case you've never seen them before, you guys change these monthly, right? The Art After Dark Different programs. theme every month. So tonight, uh, the theme is Native Visions. Yeah. And again, that's in partnership with the Urban Native Collective, which I is an amazing it. organization. Well, thank yes. you so much. Uh, and if you want to find out more information about the event, I'm sure it's on the website. CincinnatiArtMuseum.org. You got All it. Right. Thank you so much. Have a great event tonight. Thank you. See you there. And we'll be back. Sure, you could stop watching now, but let's be honest, you want to see more, so click some of those links, or better yet, go ahead and tap subscribe, that way you'll catch more content from Local 12.